Hey, Andy here from buildahottub.com. In this video, we're gonna look at all things UV for our DIY hot tubs. Let's take a look. So what is UV? Well, UV stands for ultraviolet, as I'm sure we all know, but UV systems can form part of the sanitation of our DIY hot tubs and they can be used as a, a means of getting to a chemical free tub so rather like a, a salt system that you would use instead of uh, say bromine or chlorine UV can form part of the system to take you again to that chemical free status. One of the common misconceptions of UV systems is that they actually replace your sanitizer, so your chlorine or your bromine. That's not the case. You still do need a residual sanitizer in your hot tub. So what I mean by that is if you're looking to go totally chemical free, the way that you can do it with UV, which will kill the algae and it will take away that green tint that you may see from time to time, that won't exist with a UV system that's up and running correctly. But to get to that chemical free status, you're gonna to need to use something like active oxygen. So active oxygen tablets or oxygen bleach are a chemical free, naturally forming sanitizer that you can use as an alternative with that UV system to your chlorine or your bromine. And that is how you get to a chemical free tub using a, a UV system. So what are the advantages of a UV system? Well, firstly, they're really easy to install and we'll take a look at how we do that shortly. Secondly, you can't overdose on UV. So you've got nothing to measure. Uh, there's no dipsticks that you need to do, anything like that, test strips. I, you can't overdose on it, so you literally set it and it just works. It's going to last for somewhere in the region of 9,000 hours, depending on the, on the bulb, uh, which is normally around a year to 18 months of use, and then you just simply change the bulb. It's, uh, it's really simple to do. And of course, one of the main advantages is that you can add this with something like active oxygen to create a total chemical-free tub which is kind of cool. So let's go and take a look now at how we actually install a UV system into our hot tub plumbing. Okay, so this is a UV system. It's from a company called Certikin, and it is a 15 watt system, which is the, the, the right kind of size for all of our kind of plunge pools or hot tubs or cocktail pools that, uh, that, that we're gonna build. Now, the size or the, the wattage of the bulb on the UV determines how much water it can deal with. So a 15 watt system is more than capable for a, as I said, a, a hot tub or a, a plunge pool kind of thing. So the unit itself can be installed either vertically, it can be installed horizontally, and there's no direction of flow. So you can use either side for inward and outwards. The unit itself has a one and a half inch socket. So remember, we're gonna to need to up that to a two inch, which is our water pipe. Uh, and the unit sits in line with our plumbing system. So behind me here, you can see the order of the components for the control room. So it's pretty straightforward. It just sits in line with your plumbing on the outward flow back into the hot tub. Now you'll find that most UV systems will ship with the bulb separately. So for this particular model, we've simply got to screw off the end here and you can see there that there's the connection to fit the bulb and the bulb slides into the tube with the quartz protector and then we simply screw it all back up. So this is what a UV bulb looks like, not too dissimilar to a regular light bulb and this just simply slots into the UV sanitation system. Pretty cool, really, really easy to do. Now this particular manufacturer recommends when you do replace that bulb, so every year, 18 months or 9,000 hours, that you actually replace the quartz tube that it sits in as well. Hope you found this video useful. See you on the next video. If you've liked this video, please do like, share and subscribe to the channel. See you on the next video.